Early this month, Southern Highlands Governor William Powie responded to allegations that 9.9 million kina was paid to a Pacific Industrial Resources Limited in 2016 for the design and construction of the seat of good governance building in Mendi. The governor confirmed that funding was released, but for several projects. This include the NIPA Correctional Facility, Poroma Staff Housing, and the detailed scope and design of the seat of good governance. Governor Powie also said much of the delay to the projects was due to the law and order issues in Mendi and the 2018 earthquake in the Highlands. He added the seat of good governance project construction will be awarded by the National Executive Council. However, a local Mendi son and businessman has refuted this assertion, saying the details don't add up. All of that breakup that they gave, I dispute that. Simply because the payment voucher signed by the previous administrator shows that it was for only one company and for one project. OSA has called on the provincial government to also look for the contractor and to bring them forward to answer for the delay in the project. Can the governor and all the PSTB tell the people of Southern Islands, go get this company, look for this company, who their manager is, because they would know who they gave the contract to who the owners of these companies are, and get them to explain. An official complaint regarding the alleged payment has been officially laid with the police. Assistant Commissioner of Police, Crimes and Investigative Task Force, Hodges Ete, confirmed with TV1 that a complaint has already been filed and will be investigated. It is a sad case where it's kind of like the norm in Southern Islands now, where you have half-completed com- projects, done by companies who tend to uh, uh, get the money, do half jobs and run away. Cedric Pajole, TV1 News.